We're going to do the oxidation numbers for the atoms in CuNO3-2, or copper 2 nitrate. Now, this is an ionic compound. I'm going to break it up into its constituent ions to help figure this out. You'll have to know that nitrate likes having a charge of minus 1. Likes. Nitrates always have a charge of minus 1. That's what makes it the nitrate ion. And this little two in the formula came from the fact that it was paired with a copper two plus ion. Now there's two of these, and then there's one of these, and that's what helps the charges cancel. Now this is important because a single atom with a charge, or rather a, a monoatomic ion, if you want to call it that, has an oxidation number of whatever its charge is. So copper's oxidation number here is plus two. Now nitrate's another story. Now there's two of these, but we can really just figure out the oxidation numbers within a single ion, and it's going to be the same for both of the ions. These are all non-metals. So my order of precedence for rules in oxidation numbers, if they're all non-metals, is that hydrogen likes to be plus one. Doesn't apply here. Oxygen likes to be minus two. So that means that the oxygen here has an oxidation number of minus two. And we're going to do a little bit of math to figure out what nitrogen's oxidation number is. The only other thing to know is that the sum of the oxidation numbers in a particle has to equal the total charge on the particle. So nitrogen's oxidation number, which we do not know yet, added to three oxygens. And again, each oxygen is minus two. We've agreed on that. Combined, all have to equal minus one. So something plus three negative twos will have to leave us with negative one. Now that means something minus six has to equal negative one. And that something has to be the number plus five because it's five minus six that gives you an answer of negative one. Now you can use algebra to figure that out, but you can also just probably do it by inspection. Therefore, the copper has a charge, no, oxidation number of plus two. Each ox, did I say, I said copper, each oxygen has a oxidation number of minus two, and each nitrogen has an oxidation number of plus five. Congratulations, you finessed it. Best of luck.